Those three words on the screen mean a lot to me. Yes, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. If you haven't done so on the channel, please consider doing it. It really helps us grow. It really helps us for the YouTube algorithm. Thank you very much. Thank you for your time. And I really hope you enjoy today's video. So this is a Star Wars homage repair. This is Lance's prayer, I believe it's pronounced. You know, you'd have no idea it was Star Wars apart from you could see clearly an X-Wing behind the sort of flippy version of me. And on the screen you could see the four guns of it. But yeah, let's go on a journey together. We're playing this on a Commodore 64 using a Mr. FPJ to recreate the Commodore 64. And the link where you can get this game will be in the video description below. So shoot all. All right, okay, oh dear lord, it's, it, it, you're straight into the action, aren't you? All right, that must be the Death Star in the front, and those are the fireballs. I can shoot. Okay. And these are TIE Fighters that we're shooting here. Shooting is very easy at the moment, because I'm literally holding down the, um, the, the fire button, so I'm not hammering it or anything like that. So, you know, you, you've got no digital um, bashing going on. Um, you've literally got, got holding it down and hoping for the best. So, no bonus. I guess this means I did not shoot enough ties. So, looking at the top, there's a... Oh, good lord. Here we go already. There's a high score of 1138, which means something to George Lucas. Um, there is, uh, let me see, a score of 72 that I've got. We've got six shields. And I think uh, we've basically got... Uh, let me see. Oh, dear lord, dear lord. Come on, come on, come on. Get it, get it, get it. We've got a one, which is the round we're on. And... We've got uh, another number underneath, which is how many of those I need. So I need three more, and I didn't get it. So there, high score, score, uh, round we're on. And then basically, um, can I avoid that? Uh, no, that went a bit wrong. And yeah, what, what stage I think we're at. So, very easy to control, regardless that I've lost some lives here, because I'm trying to do talking while playing it. But it plays very smooth. So this is a disc in which got up here. Look, I hit it again. This is a disc image game. I'm not just getting used to where they are in relation to where you are. And my shields are almost gone. All right, game over. That went a bit wrong, didn't it? That went very wrong. So I scored 126. But yeah, it does play very smooth. So we're going to have a version where I'm going to turn up the volume. And I'm just going to focus and play. Okay, I think it's by Dr. Terrors as well. Okay, so I've got the required amount of TIE Fighters because that's now at zero, so i got a wave bonus. Let's try and do this for the tops. We didn't do it for that two left. The problem with the tops is that they, 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 they come into they come into focus very soon, so the draw distance isn't as far away as it is on the normal arcade. So I can talk a little bit while doing this. All we've got to do is avoid the platforms and shoot the balls, the energy balls. This is really actually impressive on the old Commodore 64. It truly is. And it moves quite fast and, you know, it, it's not, it's not blast all your way through uh, and, and, and you win because it's easy. No, this is a little bit hard. Alright, I want to see um, that one on the top right hand corner go up. I think that is the wave, I can't be certain. Yes, alright, it's the wave. So we're on wave two now. I'll be quiet again to see what we can do. So 
So there we go, got that down to zero, so that is good. All right. towers we got all the towers but you know it's game over at that point game over but right, let's have another go this works really well you would never tell by the title um, that this was a Star Wars game but it is a Star Wars game we might have to remember to be pulling this one out on May the 4th on May the 4th be with you around that time but we've also got if you think of Commodore games there is another excellent Star Wars game where you basically are on off as well that one works really well but no this is great this is great this would have likely sold a lot I don't know how it compares to the original actually I really really don't but yeah this this, this, is, this is a work of love this is a great tribute of this I really really am all right we've got all the tops now what we got to do is try and stay alive there we did it wave bonus three seven eight Us. Damn it, damn those walkways. I'm quite pleased for the enemy shots. They haven't gone from wireframes. At least they've made the enemy missiles coming towards you out easy to see. Not necessarily easy to hit, because I'm playing, but it's easy to see. Got it. Right. 517 and a shield bonus. Can we get through this wave? See, that, they're all kind of shooting at us now, so it's a case of trying to, you know, get all the bullets in one go and maybe have a double hit on the ties. Six ties, five ties. Size. No bonus. Yeah, that was definitely a lot harder. Oh, got me, got me, bugger. Alright, this certainly deserves one more go. We're only about at the eight minute point in the video as well. But let's try and get a bonus in this next game. We've been zipped up a little bit the first two levels. We've done it as we fly towards the Death Star again. wasn't too bad a run. Controls are 
perfect for this, they really, really are. You know, there is no miss push buttons or anything like that, or steering or anything. It works so, so well. You know, visuals, <laughs> incredible for the Corridor 64, for what they've made it done. Speed, you know, this has some speed with it as well. You know, there's no complaints in that field. Gameplay, well, you could judge my gameplay yourself, but I think I'm doing all right this round. There we go. Boom. All right, so round two, off we go again. We achieved the goal of getting the first two levels without anything horrible happening to us. Like game over. Oh, we got the bonus here. We actually got the bonus. Not a big bonus, by the way, but we got enough. Balls, balls, balls. Well, right, while we were on top of the Death Star, that went a little bit hard, that did. And that did get hard, so let's game over. Our score took us to 792. But you know what? I've had fun with Lance's prior. I have no idea what that means. I even put it into Google Translate in case this game was written um, by someone that was of non-English native speaking language and it translated to Star Trench or something like that. But I don't know, I really don't know. But I highly recommend this Commodore 64 game. I really, really do. The URL where you can get this from will be in the video description below. If you've made it to the end of this video, thank you very much. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. It really does help us with the YouTube algorithm. I value each and every one of you that will do this for me. But beyond this, all of you stay safe, all of you take care, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.